Not only is he a Lucha Libre icon, but he's a WWE legend. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from El Paso, Texas, weighing in at 228 pounds, Eddie Guerrero. So many historic memories of Latino Heat. I know our colleague JBL speaks so highly of the respect he holds for Eddie Guerrero, one of the all-time greats. Well, Eddie Guerrero was always seen as an underdog. Granted, he would cheat on occasion to even the playing field. But hey, how can he not get behind a guy like Latino Heat? Oh, yeah, I like this guy. And his opponent, accompanied by Rhea Ripley from San Diego, California, weighing in at 200 pounds, the Superstar. I can't believe some of the things this athlete has been saying about their opponents ahead of this and every match. Just going around insulting people. Well, Saxon, I think that's completely unfair. Those insults are just part of an intricate mind game being played. That is a sound strategy for any competitor and produces an edge in this match. up against Eddie Guerrero, defend against Guerrero family values or uh, well, lack thereof. Unshakable superstars on the roster. Absolutely a picture of resilience. He's been through ups and downs, but has never given up the fight. Bitter perseverance is what will make him such a threat in this matchup. Too bad he's got to deal with one of the true craftsmen of the game, Eddie Guerrero. Better hide the steel chairs and keep an eye on the referee because Eddie is creative when it comes to cutting corners, exploiting weaknesses, and catching you unaware. And that DDT was well delivered. Is it enough? And he easily stops the ref's count. Kicking out there really has to make his opponent question his game plan. The head scissor takedown. Oh, man. He didn't need that eyebrow anyway. Eddie Guerrero firing up on the assault. A swift rhythm of offense here from Guerrero. So what's the move against a guy whose mantra is line sheet steel? Throw an extra pair of eyes in your head for a start. Eddie's always looking for the angles, and more often than not, he finds them. You really do have to fight a war on two fronts against Latino Heat. Very effective. Having a weakened arm can limit you in so many ways, making it harder to execute on even simple attacks. A tremendous pinning combination. Kicks out in just one. Coming next, a back suplex. Short throw line hits its mark. Kick to the midsection. Could be thinking about the gory special, yes. Oh, the gory special submission locked in. It's not embarrassing to tap out. He'll save your career. But his will to win is simply too strong. There will be... Trying to find a way out. Elbow into an arm drag. Beautiful escape. Has it hooked in? Goodness, inverted. 
Giant suplex. Big elbow drop. And that prevents Eddie's attack. Uh-oh, sunset. Triple verticals. Spin those hips, Eddie. There's number two. And here comes That is why you can't leave any weaknesses open for Eddie to exploit. say what we're all thinking. This was as one-sided as it gets. Absolutely no telling what's underneath the ring tonight. Clearly thinking a steel chair is what's needed right about now. Oh, this is just terrible to watch. He's in so much pain and can't do anything. 